Okay students, in the last video we have done what is force, what can force do. In this video we will do different kinds of forces. Example, muscular force, magnetic force, frictional force, gravitational force. Okay, first we will do blow your mind. What is the unit of force? Answer, Newton. In small form you can write N in the bracket. N-E-W-T-O-N. All have written. Kinds of forces. Underline. Number one, muscular force. The force exerted by the muscles are called muscular force. What is muscular force? The force exerted by the muscles. Underline muscular force. When you use your muscles to push and pull things. Walk run, cycling and so on. It is called muscular force. When you do cycling, walking, we use muscular force. Underline, you know what is muscular force? The force exerted by the muscles are called muscular force. Underline gravitational force. The force exerted by the earth that attracts all objects towards itself is called gravitational force. What is gravitational force? The force exerted by the earth that attracts all the objects towards itself. It is called gravitational force. Underline, you must have noticed that anything like a ball that you throw up always falls down on the earth. You have seen when you throw the ball upwards, it comes down. It comes down. It comes down due to the earth's gravity. It comes down due to earth's gravity. Underline, the earth's gravitational force keeps us on its surface. If there was no gravity, we would be floating in the air. If there be no gravity, what happens? We would be floating in the air. Frictional force. What is frictional force? The force that assists motion is called frictional force. Underline, when you roll a ball on the floor, it stops after moving a short distance. This is due to force of friction. You have seen, sometimes you throw a ball on the floor and it stops after some time due to force of friction. The ball stops due to force of friction. Underline. For frictional force to act, two bodies have to be in contact. Two bodies should be in the contact. Frictional force is more on rough surface. Frictional force, it is more on the rough surface than the smooth surface. Okay, underline. Frictional force is more on rough surface than on smooth surfaces. Now we will do one activity. Okay, take two balls. Roll one on the floor and other on the road. Take two balls, roll it on the floor and other on the road. Make a note of the distance they cover. You will observe that the ball on the road stops after a short distance. Which ball rolls on the road? It will stop after a short distance. While the ball that rolled on the floor covers a longer distance. Why it is so? This is because the force of friction is more on a rough surface than on smooth surface. Why? It's so because the force of friction is more on the rough surface than on the smooth surface. Okay? Underline this one. Understood? What is gravitational force? What is muscular force? What is frictional force? Now we will do magnetic force. What is magnetic force? The force exerted by the metal, the force exerted by a magnet on iron objects, it is called magnetic force. You have seen sometimes nails, pins, you bring near the magnet, it attracts. Magnet it attracts, now. it is due to magnetic force. The force exerted by a magnet on the iron objects, it is called magnetic force. It is a force that acts from a distance. Underline. Now we will do one more activity. Take two different objects like an eraser, pins, plastic scale, nails and keys. Get them close to the magnet one by one. We will observe that pins, nails and keys, 
दे फॉल मेड ऑफ आयरन गेट अटेक्टेड टू वर्ड्स अ मैग्नेट दे अटेक्टेड टू वर्ड्स अ मैग्नेट वाइल द अरेजर प्लास्टिक बुक्स पेंसिल दे वॉन्ट अटेक्टेड do not get attracted towards a magnet only iron things nails pins they get attracted towards a magnet okay understood what is magnetic force the force acted by magnet on iron object it is called magnetic force now we have done different kinds of forces number 1 muscular force gravitational force frictional force and magnetic force revise for 5 minutes then afterwards we will revise new words write on your learn for exam number 1 force a push or a pull simple what is force a push or a pull underline next muscular force what is muscular force the force exerted by the muscles speak out the force exerted by the muscles underline what is friction force the force that opposes motion underline the force that opposes motion gravitational force the force of the earth that pulls all objects towards itself it is called gravitational force the force of the earth that pulls all objects towards itself okay revise for 5 minutes next afterwards we will do the back exercises understood Okay students